everybody and welcome back to Jurassic World the game. Wow. Okay, this is the first time I'm recording since I've been back. I haven't recorded uh, in three weeks. If you didn't know, I uh, went away to Japan over the Christmas period and the New Year period as well. Uh, I had a lovely time, but we'll not talk too much about it, because I know that's why you're not here. You're here to see something that I missed while I was away. Um, and if we go into here, it's the first ever in the game. We've been waiting for this. Cross-pollination with species and types. You have herbivores with carnivores, amphibians with flyers, but this is the first time that we're seeing a different kind of... What, what would you call it? A, uh, a, a, a species um, type. Thing. <laughs> That's because they're all different species. Uh, if we go into creatures. Uh, now, I don't know exactly what it's classed as. It's probably going to be classed as a carnivore. Uh, can I select a hybrid? I will select a hybrid. Let's have a look. Let's have a look. It should be in here. There it is. This thing. The Alonogamous. An Allosaurus, rare, with a Bonogamous tournament creature to create the first ever in the game aquatic and land uh, hybrid creature. Uh, and it, I, I'm amazed. Uh, it's amazing. And we've also got this as well, uh, which actually only takes a level... Oh, wait. Velociraptor Gen 2 not ready. Uh, wait, do you need level 40 for that? And Indo Indominus Rex Gen... How are you supposed to get that? Ludia, please. Please ask, answer me this. How is anybody supposed to get an Indominus Rex Gen 2? Apart from buying packs that uh, were on offer. And even then, I think if you bought the packs, I don't think you'd have a chance of getting it. Because you only buy so many. Um, so I would love a statement written, sent email. Thank you. <laughs> to how I tell you what, give me an Indominus Rex Gen 2 and I'll say, you've done a good job. There you go. <laughs> Is that much of a price? No, but I'm really looking forward to this thing. The The picture doesn't look too great. Like, that's got shading on it. This guy, however, has no shading. But the model, uh, I I think, looks really good. So, we're going to jump into our uh, carnivores. We're going to find our Allosaurus, because we only need to get one. And fuse it, because I am... Um, ooh. ooh we, well, we've already got things. That's right. Because even though I haven't played... Well, actually, I haven't played this in weeks. Um... Uh, maybe I'll put footage up. I'm, I'm not too sure uh, if I'm... Can I be bothered? Probably not. <laughs> but if I have, there you go. Of uh, stuff I did in Japan. Uh, I recorded a video while I was over there. Still got to edit that and put that together. Hopefully it's something you'll find interesting. It was something that uh, you... I mean, you don't normally go... Uh, it's not on a tourist uh, bucket list if you're in Japan to do, but... It, it, it's just something that I thought, you know what, I'm going to do that. I'm going to do that. And I think you guys will find it quite interesting. Um, the story in itself is very interesting as well, but I'm not going to tell you anything more. You have to wait and see. Uh, 4,500 for a Conoraptor? Yeah, no. Um, what's this? 9,000 for that? No. If it was the other way around, then yes. 22 for 1 million coin. Bugger off. Tell you what, give you a uh, trade a coin for DNA. Hell yeah, we'll do that. And we can try and start working on our um, levels for the, the rank. So if we go into battle here, there shouldn't be anything in particular. Ooh, oh, we got to test this. Okay, well, hold on, guys. We've got to do this quickly. We've only got 60 minutes and we can win some DNA. So bear with me. We'll do this. Um, so I've seen a lot of people commenting. Uh, saying that when's Jurassic World the game come back, when's, um, of course, it is now. Uh, so, I mean, uh, like, what I love about these episodes, and I'm sorry there is no face cam today, I have not had a shave and I look hideous. Plus, um, the camera's uh, memory cards, SD cards, um, aren't sorted out, so I can't even record it that way. But, uh, the main reason is, I don't want to scare you with my face. <laughs> Who's got a great big bushy beard? No, I, I couldn't grow one if I tried, gotta be honest. Um, no, uh, it, it's interesting when it comes to YouTube, um, because it's such a, such a new industry. And I'm not talking about the medium of creating content online, I'm talking about the psychological impacts and uh, effects that it has on one's person when they every day upload content um, on YouTube, there's a pressure to always have uh, the content ready, uh, to be there, to just, you know, be there for the channel. Let's say something goes wrong and you're like, well, I can delete that, I can edit that, maybe I can upload this, I can, you know, put out a statement or something. And um, 
I don't know, it's just, it's something that when I was going away and it's, it's a practice that I've always put um, onto this channel is that if I ever go away or I go to do something, I don't, I don't tell people. I don't say, oh, I'm, I'm going away in so many days. Um, for my, from my own perspective and my own quote unquote research, when people have done that, um, the, the views drop on the channel. Um, and I think this is a correlation between the audience and the creator. There's not a correlation, a, a connection. That because you guys know that, or the audience knows that the creator isn't there, then they don't feel a, well, a sense of, I don't know, that interaction being there with said creator because they're not technically there. Uh, whether this is true for everybody, of course it's not. Um, I would uh, be amazing. If, I'd be amazed if it was. Um, but I think that it, maybe it's not true. But I think partially it is to some extent. Um, and I, I, when I was going away, I, that's one of the reasons why I never made this big. Okay, I'm going away. Blah blah blah. blah. But I will tell you when I come back because I'm here. <laughs> um, but. This was the first holiday that I took that um, I didn't have things sort of planned. Um, I, I had a couple of videos. Hopefully, Spanish was conducted out. Doesn't got the greatest of attack. Was three enough? Oh, just, just, just enough. That was close. Um, yeah, it was the first time I went away that I didn't have content ready, um, which is kind of daunting. Because every time I've went away, you know, for the past four or five years, I've been doing this channel. Whenever I've went away, I've always had content ready. Uh, whether it's every day, every other day, it's it's always there. But this time, I I mean, I I was I've been away. I still feel like I'm recovering from all the trips that I did at Gamescon and the Basking Shocks and Scotland and down in London. All these trips that I was. You know, I was grinding to have content ready for when I was away then that I've never recovered so that when I went away to Japan, I just, I, I, whether I was just running low on fuel because I have been, you know, um, oh, should we do it? Well, do our code 19. Go on, let's get some Monolophosaurus DNA. May as well. It might be another five years before we get another hybrid, but hey, if we do this, maybe it'll only be two. Um... So yeah, I, I didn't really have content ready. I did do one series, which is that Jurassic World Evolution series. That was one thing that I had said that I was gonna do and I was looking forward to doing and it turned out really fun. Um, but I knew if I only have so much time to de de you know dedicate to making content before I go away, I was like, okay, what would my audience really like? Um, of course, you know, everybody has their, oh, damn, I missed it. Everyone has their preferred series, whether it's Jurassic World The Game, Jurassic World Live. Um, Power World, because I still see that. I still see in the comments as a guy who's like, Where's Power World? <laughs> it's dead. Okay, leave it. <laughs> oh, dear. Um, but so he's always there. I, I give him credit. He's tenacious. Uh, same with Dragon Riser Burke. I see that every now and again as well. Please come back to Dragon Riser Burke. Um, and the thing is, we cover so many things on this channel, but. T to an extent, I have to I have to think of the majority. I have to think of what appeals to the the most amount of people because I can't, you know. I if I was, oh, that's right, you're there. Ha <laughs> ha! Done. Yes. Oh, it's not a tournament creature anymore. Oh, VIP, you bugger, Ludia, you deliberately did that. I bought loads of these guys because they were so good. They were all VIP, and now it's not VIP. I think, or is, is there another one? Is there another, another one that is VIP? Let's have a look. Because one was promoted. Oh no, it's this guy. No, never mind. They didn't change it. No, I was just, it was just something I was like, oh, I'll put that in. Um, so, oh yes, God, come on. We've only got 10 minutes. We can do it. Put that in. Let's go. Um, what was I saying? What was I saying? Uh, traveling away, content. Um, Oh, y yes, that's right. I, and I was thinking, what, what could what could people like? What do they want to see? If they could see any series from me, what would they like to see? Oh, and I've died. Fantastic. Well, we'll just give up there. <laughs> oh, no. Okay, fine. We'll do another one. All right, all right. And I thought the aisle. You peep I could always guarantee that people will like the aisle. Um, so I spent, I spent one day just playing, like, literally all day, the aisle. Um, and I never uploaded the whole series. Yet it is still to come, and I need to check in whether um, I'm still like I still have the dinosaur on that server, because that would suck. 
Is this? This seems like a really quick one. Did it? It said like four. Four. Oh, sorry, four or six. That's right. I was like, wait, we only got two left. No, it's the whole thing. I was gonna say. Is that this alone? That's six. Come on, can we get a perfect score? Lots of DNA. Papa needs a new pair of Indominus Rexes. Oh, we've done it, and the next one will be a, sw a thing at the bottom, but we should be able to get it. <gasps> Woohoo! Yes, 150 DNA change to 400. That doubled it. And then some. And we'll do. You know what? We, we got time. We got time. Oh, this one's going to be a tricky one. Metrophoton. Woo! You know, if you have higher or rarer uh, level creatures, like, um, no, like this guy in your park, um, then you have more of a chance of getting more super DNA. Because you only get three a day, I think it is. Oh, it's a shame that I missed that. Whoa, that was lightning fast. And I'm surprised I got that. I was red for the majority of that. But I think as long as you follow the path to an extent, no, oh, no! Oh, no. <laughs> oh, come on. Uh, this is this is the hardest one, this type, because there's a certain presets, and this one's the hardest one because you get three times the thing at the bottom. So they will finally land here. Yep. Yep. There it is. There we go. Okay. As long as we end it in the green, we get the ten that we were promised. So, oh, come on, we've got eight minutes. Ooh, let's go. Ooh, let's go. Come on, come on, come on. All I need to land is three hits. Come on, hit me with two. Hit me with two. Come on. Damn it. Okay, well, let's risk the biscuit. Let's go for three. Oh, I block for two. That, that's it. We're done. We're out of here. Um, so, I mean, I hope you guys... And, and the thing is as well, just like with anything, you know, people have free time of the weekends. That's when people are more active on YouTube and watching content. In general, is doing things that they like to do. Um, and I thought that's when I would put the videos up. It was more more around the uh, weekend time. So um, maybe you didn't you know you didn't know I was going away because hopefully you didn't. I may have kept that secret. Um, and uh, just thank you for the support on the channel. Uh, oh God, seven minutes and then we get that one. Well, we'll wait. Well, seven minutes to do this one. You joking? Look at that now. Nah. <laughs> well, well, well. It's about time. We got something we've been waiting for for a long time. The Bernogamous and Alasaur Hybrid. Now, I, I think I've seen it start to level 40, and it's pretty darn good. So, uh, let's just speed up. It's only four hours, is it? So, here it is. <gasps> and it's another bleeding carnival. Oh, 989 health and 445 attack. Damn, that's good. So there it is, unlocked at level 40, 5,489 health and 2,466 attack. That definitely puts it in the top 10 uh, if you get it maxed up. So let's have a look. Ooh, look at you. You blend in. Mm, I like it. It's nice. It's nice. It, it, you know, it has the monogamous fin that goes around the side. Um, it does. I, I like its dinosaur face, the, the sort of... Uh, it's more, I, I've seen people say it's more like an Allosaur looking than the actual Allosaur in the game, and well, you're probably right. <laughs> it does have three fingers, I suppose. Hey, they fixed the Allosaur. <laughs> like the Allosaur, Alogmus is known to prey on large herbivores like Stegosaur. Is it? Is it now, Lydia? Because it certainly doesn't look like it would. Looks like it'd be very delicate with that sail. And you know what they say? Um, with, well, you know what I tell you. If you're gonna get a hybrid, make sure to get um, two of them because it's uh, it's probably worth it. And uh, the only problem is we lose one of our better um, aquatic creatures for yet another freaking carnival. He does, wow, 53,000 on par with Cygnus Sutures. For about 500 health, you get half the attack almost. Ooh, is it worth it? No. No, 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 no. Because for 10,000 or 9,000 extra DNA, you get double the attack and 100 extra health. For 10,000 DNA. And Pachygalosaurus... Ah, you could argue Pachygalosaurus is worth it. Actually, out of all of these creatures, it's, it's not worth it. It is not worth it. You look at Serizinosaurus. You look at those stats. It's got more health, more attack, even. Why does it cost less? Why does Serizinosaurus cost less when it's got more health and more attack? We, okay, this needs a balance. This Alonogamus needs a, ba a balance. 
it either needs its price reducing to about 40,000 maybe. Or Serizinosaurus is really good for its money. Um, but it does seem like everything adds up except for Alon uh, Alonogamous. Alonogamous. Uh, it's even, it even makes less coin if that's something you're even bothered about. So I'm expecting to see... I mean, come on, Ludia, man. You add like one dinosaur in at a certain time. Can you not balance it properly? Like, look at that. Who's, who's looking at this? Oh, look at it. Oh, yeah, that's right. <laughs> you know what? You know why I'm annoyed? Because I have to bloom and buy it and spend books on it. Oh, God, look at that. I've only got 4,000. Well, there we go. We'll get that to level 20. 140 and... Oh, God, no. Decline. In What? Interest-based ads? I agree to disclose my advertising ID of my device to Ludia to receive interest-based advertisement tailored to me. My any data that is shared is to ensure that I receive a quality game experience. I understand that I can always withdraw. So, ooh, no, no, I'm declining it. Wait, what? I said decline. Why are you get? Why are you give me it? What? Oh, there you go. Okay, so apparently, I I clicked decline and it still gave me an advert. So I'm hoping that they are not going to be stealing my information. Oh God. <laughs> my data. Luddy, you know what it is? You do make some good games, but it just seems like you, you're focused on Jurassic World Live at the moment, and you just, it's like you, you've just got a free, oh, we can get away with anything with Jurassic World the game right now. It's like, ah, just put, let's use their data and put in a speed up feature. Yeah, let's not look at the balance creatures. Ah, just keep, I mean, come on. <laughs> anyway, I think that saved me one book. And even then, didn't get it done. So we're gonna have to spend more and more and see the result. Yeah, there we go. Okay, so hopefully this time we'll get some shadow on this dinosaur. Uh, no, still no shadow. Hmm, interesting. Well, let's claim our food rewards, eh? Through a land-dwelling creature, although a land-dwelling creature, a log allogamous aquatic instincts often lead it to shoreline hunting grounds. What does it look like in Evolution 40? Oh, we just get to see it? It's not grayed out? Oh, perfect, we get to see it all it's on. So at level 40, its fins are a little bit big. It has some fins on its, um, what do you call it? Ah, that, that is interesting. They, they, yeah, they've glitched it. Well, at least they've forgotten about it. <laughs> oh, dear man. It's got more spikes on its head. Uh, it's got fins on its arms. Yeah, not too bad, not too bad. But at the moment, it has how much attack? 1,924 health and 865 attack. Take! Let's max up, take it to 2,542 health and 1,143 attack. Oh, yes. But do can I spend thousands of more bucks on it? I would have to spend another 3,000 bucks just to get another um, two of them. And then I'm going to have to speed those up. That would make a level 30. But you know what? Level 20 with 1,100 attack for another carnivore dinosaur. I don't think we need it. So I'm, I'm not going to do that. Whoa! What the flip's this? Oh, yeah. Exclusive excavation. That's right. Do you get a guaranteed? Is the cat is Procopted? I miss Procopted on. I'm so sorry, guys. Um, little Coco Puff. I was away, and I think he was only four VIP members. You know what it is? They wait until I take away my VIP membership, and then they make it better. Um, but wait, what was that exclusive? Hold on. Was it not in here? It looked like that was a fish, right? The exclusive offer. Where is it? It's not in here. You saw that, right? That was something else on the right. I don't know what that was. Hold on. Let's have a look. It was an aquatic. It looked like a fish. Let's have a look. Aquatic creatures. No, it was none of those. No, no, no. Nope. Nope. There it was. It was Hyneria. That's right. Unlock via special events. So we have Hyneria, Lee Zichthys. Now, I don't know if this has been released yet. I don't- I saw this. 
I saw this when I went, I can say this now because it's basically released. Um, I saw this when I went to visit the studios and oh, it looks so good. I'm so glad that Lee Sixties is coming to the game. It's one of those creatures that was in Jurassic Park Builder, I think when it, Aquatics first came out and it looked so, it was like, oh, it's just so good. And I'm so glad it's a legendary, like it's actually going to be used. Uh, Hyneria as well. Uh, so the only way to get it, uh, special offer is to go. Can we go to special offer? Oh, there you go. We can get a level 10 lead Zikthys. Um, only a hundred quid. Only a hundred. Oh, man. Only a hundred. Really? Come on, Lydia. Okay, tell you what. You want to make more money? I might have bought it if it was a tenner. I might have bought it if it was a tenner. Just so I could get it early. But that it's a hundred quid. I can't do that. I mean, is, is the theory that... Well, you've got 10 times more chance of, you know, if you put it down to a tenner. But if one person pays 100 quid for it, well, there you go. You've got 10 sales at, at, at 10 quid. Is that the theory behind it? Ooh, it's ruthless and money hungry. But we've come to expect that. <laughs> what about Hyneria? It's, that was the one that had a special offer. Oh, so you can get it in Claim Your Territory. So what's the special? 99 quid for this as well. 99 quid. <gasps> oh dear. It, I mean, what about Suchodus? No, there's no way to get Suchodus. I think that's a tournament creature though. But it looks like we have an event to possibly get it. So we should do that. Whoa. Are you kidding me? What is with that? Where is, where is uh, Alonamagus? About one. Th oh god, 1000 attack really puts it quite low on the roster. Yeah, there he is, level 20, around about the same as Ankylodocus. Really, it's not, because it's, you know, her before is way more needed. But, but I would like to see it. But before we do that, um, I've got a surprise for you. How about, ooh, let's claim those. Yes, yes, yes. And let's go over to Isla Sauna, Site B. Whoosh! Because look at all of the precious John Ammons we've got. Oh, they're glorious. <laughs> Yes, I'm not level 85, but maybe at the end of this, I will be. So this is what I've been doing my spare time. I've been grinding. Any cash that's been left over from getting uh, the the Raptor Squad things, I've been doing this. So hopefully, we, c we can at least get one level. I don't know about two, just because the amount of XP you need these days is so much. Come on, come on, we got this, we got this. We got this. Oh, it's so close. It's so close. And we, oh, and we've lost connection to the server. So we got 20 bucks. Oh, we got some Velociraptor DNA. That's good. Oh, and also, I did the lottery. So let's see what we got. A lot of food. Who didn't see that coming? Full more food. Who didn't see that coming? And the final one, even more food. Who didn't see that coming? Good God. I mean, I probably ended something like that, except for it was all food. Uh, not really worth it, is it? Right, let's keep on going. Is it possible to get level 82? Because then we can... I, oh, yeah, also people have told me that the unlimited battles uh, or the battle stage infinite, um, now you don't unlock specific creatures. And people are annoyed about that. It just seems to be packs uh, that you get. So you don't... I mean, to be fair, you're, it's probably better that you win packs than just a specific creature because then, you, you know, you're winning DNA and that you can use that DNA... Um, to purchase that creature. Uh, unless you need to be a certain level to unlock that. I'm not too sure. Oh, it was close. I didn't think we would get it, but level 81 is close. Um, even a little bit of more super DNA. Um, was there anything that I was... Oh, yeah, I was wanting to collect coin. I may as well collect coin. Woohoo! 94 million! Uh, what's my mission? Uh, place a newly hatched ter pterosaur. And that's it. How much do I get for that mission? Uh, 6,000, oh, sorry, 66,000. I don't even know how much I get for a... You know what, should we do that? Let's get an Alanqua. Um, can we speed up 10 minutes? We may... Let's watch an advert. Oh, here we go. Mazran is going to be so happy. Oh, no! <laughs> They're full. Oh, damn it. Sell more, sell more, sell them all. Come on. Okay, collect it and place it. 
We got this, we got this place. There we go, Mizran is so happy with me. Mizran is taking some time to test out the new corporate airship. You know, from beyond the graves. How much do you need? I'm, oh, I'm not gonna see how much XP that got me. She handles like a dream. It's like flying a cloud. That's it. Oh, we get. Oh, we really isn't anything at this point. Great, come back. Don't touch nothing if you don't know what it is. How am I supposed to know what it is? I've never been this close to a grass level before before. Don't argue with me. Just listen to it. Blah, 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 blah. <laughs> uh, buy a place three top it. That's it? Oh, hold on. This is going to be really easy. Hold on, guys. Let me just, uh, let me just place a top it. Um, I'm assuming it's a decoration. Tar pits. Look at all those trophies we've got. Oh, and the booster legacy. Oh, I never placed it. Or at least, I maybe I did? Tar pit. Tar pit, tar pit. Where are you, Mr. Tar pit? It's the mammoth, right? If I remember right, it's the mammoth. Yep, there it is. There's one. The good thing is, now we can easily go into the market, put it down like that, and there we go. Uh, there's one... There's two, and there you have it. So that's 30 bucks, may as well. Rawr, roar! Ugh, what was that sound? Get inside the plane. Bah! I'm more worried about what's outside with this. <gasps> Flight Path, episode 30. Oh my god, I haven't done this in so long. I forgot all about this. Uh, are you sure that Owen said InGen? That's only part of the call that came in loud and clear. The West was garbled. But that doesn't make any sense. There shouldn't be anything left from engines and installations. Maybe we didn't dig deep enough. I'll see if I can find the specs from the old park. Buy and place five new buildings and collect three million coins for- Oh my god. There it is. There's another one. I can do one easy, but uh, the collect three million coins from buildings is a little bit hard. You have to place a lot of buildings. I mean, a lot of buildings quite close to things. I guess something, I could pro well, I'm gonna sell all those. I'm gonna sell all them, replant them, but here we go. Let's do the Bal stage infinite. Um, and in its infinite glory, we can actually, let's choose carnivores. Cause that should put the aloe thing a lot closer. There it is, beauty. Um, and then let's just go to regular Jurassic. Fly down a little bit, go for that, and then go for that. That should be it. And here we are, yes! Ooh, it looks cool. Okay, let's slow down the animations. We can kill it in one hit. But hopefully we don't die in two hits. Bam! We're gonna die in two hits? Oh, we're dead in two hits. Okay, well, we're gonna see it die, so that's good. <laughs> no! Bam! Well... There you have it. We saw it. Uh, and that's 2,600. So we're going to have to go for two reserves. We're going to speed up now. It's probably going to switch in the Apatosaurus. Only oh, has one attack though, I think. Doesn't even go for it. So we'll switch into Carnaraptor. Uh -huh. um, and we'll go for four reserves here. Ooh, there you go. Well, he's going to switch out again. So he's already wasted two turns. Three. Oh, he can kill me in two though. Ooh, I was hoping he wasn't gonna do it. So he's got he's got three. We have seven. So one, two, <gasps> well, and then one, two, three, and then one reserve. Oh, well, there you go. Um I think Apatosaur still has to go for like three to four hits, I think. Probably probably three. I'd assume, because it's more like 800 attack it's got. Oh no, it had to go for four! Ooh. I would have, I'd probably just have survived. Although, saying that, I did have one reserve. That's probably why they went for the one extra. So, there. Oh, is three enough? Oh, well, it didn't even matter because I only had 265 health. I mean, attack. <laughs> so, four hits wouldn't have killed me. So, 160 DNA plus 6,000 DNA. And we get to do the next one, which is a Zalmoxy. So, what do we have? 7,000 DNA, uh, Balsage 82. 7,000 DNA, uh, Ample DNA Pack. And then, finally, we get a free Agantha Stager. So, let's do the Zalmoxies. Um, ooh, it's a lot of carnivores. Something like... Uh, should I just have my own carnivores? I'd, I'd rather just go for my own carnivores. Whoa! Indominus Rex. Uh, yeah, let's just go for one hit. That'll do it. And we're against a Cerizinosaurus, is it? A Cerizinosaurus at level 10. Really? It's nothing to worry about, pet. 
Two? You can't kill me. You can't kill me. You have no power. Bam! Ah, uh, who remembers the glory days when Indominus Rex just came out? Oh, I do. Oh, I remember those. <laughs> oh, I'm such a little weird whippersnapper. Oh, Soprana Titan. Mmm, might as well just go all our way. 1,000, 2,000, 3,000. Oh, just kill them. That was a lot. 4,800 when, I mean, if you add them all up, the bonus is so much. So it's another 160 plus... You own one Zalmoxies! Woohoo! Did I just- Oh no, I've got two now. Fantastic. Look at that. Look at the disgrace that was the bloomin' DNA building. I can't! I can't pay for it! I can't pay for VIP now. Because I've lost all of that progress. And Ludia, if you're watching, tell you what. I will join VIP back if it's free. Okay? <laughs> I'll do that. So what do we get? Is there anything added extra to this? Solid gold packs apart from Panthacus. Is there anything there I need apart from the yeah Panthacus and the Thalacus Millis? That one. Um, and then maybe I mean I could still do that one, but even for VIP to get a woohoo source, it's something like fifty thousand. So it's really not worth it. The reason why they don't show you how much that pass pack costs is because you would go no even if i had vip i wouldn't buy it Fifty thousand, it's too much so even if i did have vip pro copted on kind of not worth it oh wait we got another one <gasps> how much is it to get um to get thingy back uh 12 hours which is 169 go on i'll do it once i'll do it once i won't use them this actually should i use them i think i can use them why is that Urlophosaurus in there? It's got no help. I guess it's because the attack's kind of similar to Uryops. Um, but we'll go for a flyer. Uh, I'll tell you what, I'll put you in first. Then do that, switch you out. Then do Jurassic. And we'll find a flyer that can probably kill it in one hit. Maybe Pterodactylus? Oh, I don't really want to use him though. Ugh, he's really good and to waste him on this. But hey ho, there you go. Right, Pterodactylus. Oh, we can't kill it. Ah, maybe you'll switch into the Pelicomimus thing. Oh, he does. Oh, uh, yeah, no wonder. Gets a big attack advantage. Right, let's go for reserves here. Let's gun for some reserves. Three. I'm going to put in Spineraptor. I'm going to put in Spineraptor because I'm expecting him to die. So one, two, and then one extra. Yep, and there it is. You always played safe, always put... I usually put two extra in, but I didn't have too many reserves there, so I thought one would be enough. So, one, two, three... He's gonna have to go for four to kill me? Yep, there it is. Right, come on, there it is. Oh, God, it's bioluminescent. All right, we're gonna switch into you. Um, I think it might have one. So, we'll go for that. We'll go for one extra. Aha, he did! Whoosh! Lophosaurus now. Mm. Can't. Ooh, could it kill me in four? I don't think so. It'd be very close though. So let's go for four reserves and one block. Let's see what it does. Come on, kill me. <laughs> kill me. Go for six. I want to see uh, Alum. I mean, we, we already know what his animation is going to be like. Sod it. We're going to switch him in. We're going to switch him in. Boop. And then how much damage can we do? So. I can do 17,000, probably 20,000, if I had my aid. Oh, we did two block. Rah! Look at it. Look how it isn't fixed. <laughs> I don't know how they do I mean, it's been ages they added something into the game. How do you mess it up like that? No shadow, no silhouette to see it's level 40. And its DNA is absolutely broken. So there you go. We've only got one, two, three, four left. Um... If we do this one... Oh, God, that's so tough, though. Oh, this one's even tougher. Ah. Which one? Micro SDNA? We've got to do that one, because you just get way better rewards. So, here's how we're going to play it. We've got a level 10 Indoraptor to force in the Nundagosaurus. And then, we will pick off the Nundagosaurus with a... Ba -ba -ba -ba. I think I lost my Pterodactylus. And it's got 12,000 health! Oh, we need Metropodon! And then to finish off, we need something baller. 
something like, in fact, actually, you know, I'm just going to put in two Indoraptors level 20. That's what we need. We need the Indoraptors in the house to kill this thing. Because these are really tough opponents. I mean, like, you can't get these. A freaking level 248 rare Pachyceratops. Jesus. All right. Okay. Oh, my God. A 4,000 attack. It's insane. But it's good, because now they have to, even if they kill my Indoraptor, they're going to have to switch out Severus and Asaurus to get that advantage. And there it is. Whoa, walloped. Okay, okay. Metrophodon, you can do this. I believe in you. We've only got three battles to do. So one, two, it's dead. Factor in one, just in case, and that's it. We've won. Wabash. Ooh, he can kill me in two hits. Uh, does he have five? He only has three, so we might not even risk it. Oh, the swap. Still has to kill me in two hits. Oh, only goes for one. He's only got one block. You fool. Come in, Indoraptor. Show him. Kill him. Hi. <laughs> and one extra. And there you go. Done and done. Ooh so even, I mean, the, the opponents we're facing, apart from the Serenus and the Saurus, were super tough. 12,000 health. Jesus, what's, I mean, what is the most amount of health a dinosaur can have, like, that you can get? 12,000, that is ridiculous. Anyway, there we go. Kills him. Oh, I, oh, I didn't even click anything there, he just didn't want to show me his death. It was too brutal, too gruesome. Two more battles, okay. A Majungasaurus level 2,459. Can it be stopped? Oh, the humanity. Well, um, it's definitely not going to be killed in one hit by anything. Not even Metroflon could kill it in one hit. <sighs> okay, okay, okay. Let me think. We need another Metrophodon, really. The Gorgosuchus and their Metrophodon. <sighs> you don't. Right, okay. I will go for one reserve. Then they will switch in their Gorgosuchus. Um, I will, I could just use Udon just to get loads of reserves off. Uh, and then if I do that, um, is, uh, Majungasaurus is still going to come in second. So if I put Segnosaurus in there, it doesn't, ah, uh, he can, I mean, he can kill it, but then Majungasaurus is going to have a, a huge advantage and kill me in one hit. Um, uh, oh, it's tough. Oh, it's really tough. I think that's the best I'm going to do. Um, I mean, really? You want flyers? But this game just doesn't have any good flyers. Just Metrophodon, but Metrophodon costs so bloody much. I think I need to invest in another Metrophodon. I think that's what I need to do. So I'm going to go for one reserve here. I'm expecting him to switch. Now, look at this. He could do oh, over 7,000 damage in one hit. The Gorgosuchus, however, couldn't do 7,000 damage in one hit. Oh, my God. Oh, he might kill me if he goes for it. <laughs> He's got one block. He's got one freaking block. Okay. Oh, no. Oh, no. No, no, you fool. Ah. Well, that's okay. That's okay. That's okay. He might he, he might do it. He might go for an all-out attack. Yes. Okay, I meant to do that. I meant to do that. I lured him into that. All right. So I only have to go for one hit here. So I go for one, one, two, and then three reserves. Now, the reason why I'm going for two block... Uh, is because he's going to switch a Metrophodon. A Metrophodon can kill me in two hits. So I need that. There it is. Ooh, it's plumbing close like. Oh, he does go for one. Okay. Now, I think that was three. Oh, it's four. Ooh. Right, Sarah's in a Saurus. I'm going to switch you in. You're going to go for four here. Two will kill it. Factor in two just in case because I haven't been paying attention. And there we go. Wallop. And um, 3,040. There's really not much attack with the advantage, is it? One, two... You probably go for five to kill me, I think. Yep, there it is. And we've done it! What a win! And we'll just go all out, shall we? Because he has nothing, I don't think. And... Bam! 28,000. I think it was. Was it 2,800? Either way, he's dead. Right, and the final one. Okay, what we got? Ooh, we got Metrophodon level 26. Um, it looks like it wants me to go for Segna Sutures, and you know what? I'm more than happy to oblige. I'm gonna go for that, sorry, this team. 
There we go. We, we, we've secured the, the victory here. There's no way we could lose. Level 700 super source and level 600 quits it. Nah. Don't stand a chance. Oh, amazingly switched out, actually. Again, one hit, but he just wants the type advantage, I suppose, or at least a neutral type. Two. Mm. Mm. I want to use my power ups. Can I just not use my power ups on regular battles? Like the mods. That would be so much better. Let me use the mods. Damn it, Lydia. <sighs> I mean. That's what's good about them, is that I, oh, I, I, maybe I can't do this battle, but with mods, I can. If you just, um, have mods exclusively to only other mod battles, then it sucks, because then it's, just, it's like this battle here. These are way overpowered, and I'm facing them with my best creatures. Uh, and with the mods, it's like, oh, well, I can use my mods, but they've got really good mods as well. So it's just, it's, both are hard battles. I would love, and I've said it before, and this is it within 40 minutes of the video, so I'm expecting them not to hear it, but if you do, please put it in. Mods for regular battles. It just makes it so much, it makes it fun. And that's what you want to do with the game. You want to make it fun. And sure, there are people probably working on this game uh, that want to do that. Maybe the higher ups don't uh, let them do that. So I sympathize with you greatly. <laughs> All right, okay. Ooh, one hit isn't enough. We need to go for two. And then sod it. I'm just going to go for four reserves. I'm going to... I'm going... All the marbles. All the marbles. Can he kill me with four? He can. Is he going to do it? No. Oh, he does it. Oh. <laughs> Good job, Interrupter has eight. He gets to do his little shark fin impression. Intr it's an interesting camera angle. Ready for it? Ready? Shark fin. <laughs> <laughs> and there you have it. We have won micro SDNA. Ooh, lots of Yupasafs. And 40 um, Sarkasugas DNA. That's great. I think I needed 770, I think, in order to get... Am I close to getting any of them? How much do I need for this guy? I don't even... Sarkasugas? Oh, come on. 1,700 for Capra Sutures. Do I have it? Let's have a look. Capra Sutures. I'm, I've got to be close. Capra Sutures, Capra Sutures, level 10. Go to... Hybrid. Oh. Wait, what? Wait, what do I need? Hold on. Hold on. I can just go in here and go on to Super Hybrids. Right. Spinata Sutures. Right. It is that guy. Okay. So it's Spino Raptor. There you are. Let's go to you. Fuse? Ah, oh, I need 2,000. Ah, <laughs> damn it. <laughs> well, anyway, guys, there you have it. Ooh, let's claim. Claim the rewards. Oh, we didn't We didn't get one for that? Oh, I get, well, I guess you get Super DNA anyway. But there you go. It is not dead. We are back. And I will be continuously playing this until I die. So if you enjoyed this video, leave a like. And until next time, I'll see you later. Oh, bye-bye.